you know i often feel that i'm not really someone who can tell you guys what to do in i think that you all know your own minds well enough and and i think each one of us you know finds our own path uh, so what has been important to me uh, which i'd like to share with you is that i have always believed in following my dreams i, I don't know how that happened I, i'm not quite sure how that happened but i think it was it also happened because i'm very uh, passionate about whatever i do whether it's my work which is films whether it's playing sport whether it's you know hanging out with my friends whether it's having an argument whether it's you know laughing about something i'm very very passionate about everything and i give my entire attention and full uh, everything about me is in that one thing that i'm doing at that time i i think that what has been very important for me is that i i don't want to compromise with what i want to do what is my dream i don't mind compromising to achieve my dream but i don't want to compromise the dream itself so that is something that i've always believed in i believe that uh, you know all through my career i've been told that he's not going to last for more than a year because of the kind of you know i've picked very unusual films i worked in a very unusual way by the restaurant industry at that time when i came in 25 years ago was doing 30 films at one time actors were doing 30 films at one time i started doing you know like three films and then i came down to one film and everyone thought okay yeah, this guy is nuts you know this and everyone who i knew and who even cared for me always told me that you know i think you make a mistake and this is a fascinating thing right through my life every important decision of mine all the people who are important to me and who are close to me have always told me you are making a mistake don't do this i appreciate the fact that people who are close to me are concerned about me i appreciate the fact that they care for me and they worry for me but what I, what i have always been happy about myself is that i have always done what i believed so i'll give you two three examples when i was in the 12th that's when i decided that i want to learn about film making in cinema so i told my family my friends everyone around me that you know i want to start working as an assistant director and start learning about film making everybody i knew at that time my parents of course freaked out you know when we graduate you could leave your studies it was halla ho gaya tha ghar mein and uh, my uncles and aunts they were all like you can't do this my cousins people my age who i thought could understand me my friends said yaar jo bhi hai graduation to kar le do what you want you want to be an actor you want to be a filmmaker do what you want but at least be a graduate it didn't make sense to me i was like why if i want to be a doctor do i study commerce no i study medicine If I want to be an engineer, I study engineering. If I want to be a filmmaker, I want to study filmmaking. Why on earth should I waste time studying something else when I'm very clear that this is my goal? So no, no, because you need a paper which says you're a graduate. That all was told to me. I said no, I don't need a paper. I don't need someone to tell me what I know. I know what I know, and if I need to know something, I learn about it. So I was very clear that I this is what I want to do. So I didn't listen to anyone. I didn't listen to my friends. I didn't listen to my family. I just did what I wanted to do because I feel that if I'm clear about what I want to do and I'm honest about it and I'm sincere about it, and the reasons why I'm doing it is 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 clear to me, then I must follow my instinct because I'd rather even if I have to go wrong tomorrow, I'd rather go wrong on my instincts. I don't want to go wrong on somebody else's advice. If I have uh, taken a wrong step, I will deal with it. I will learn. It will be a learning experience for me. So, right through my life, I have noticed that there has been times when people who are close to me and who care, who care about me, have told me you are doing the wrong thing. And I have always felt that I have listened to them very carefully. I have never ignored them. Uh, but I finally did what I felt like doing, and, and that's one thing that I, when I look back today after twenty-five years of of being a professional, I feel that that's one thing that I. I feel happy about that. I lived on my terms. See, today I'm successful. I may not have been successful. I may not have been successful. I didn't know I was going to be successful. But I, I'm happy that I lived on my terms, and I'm happy that I never compromised. Whenever I was offered something I was not happy with, I didn't do it. I have always done what I believed. In. So even the films that have not worked or have not turned out that way, I believe in them, and they are mistakes which I own, uh, and, and and I. Hold them very close to me because I feel that, in fact, I have learned the maximum from my failures. 
my failures have taught me the most and, and so I, I really value my failures whatever I am today is because not only because of my successes but also because of my failures whatever I've learned through my failures and, and so I have always done what I believe in and I continue to do that.